expecting this. Okay. Good thing I looted everything out of the house first. Didn't really walk back here at all. Can do it himself, so he tried to blow me up. Me? Well, this ends today. Desmond Lockhart will finally win out. I know where he is. He overplayed his hand this time. You and me are going to walk in there and end this. Well, that's good, since the game is almost done. He's in here, the little fuck, right under my nose the whole time. Hiding behind robots and machines. What a miserable life. Pathetic. He dies now. I suggest you hurry your pretty self up. I'm sure the bastard's got some sort of escape plan. The only reason I'm helping him out is because the other guy killed the dogs. And if there's one thing I hate more than a dick, it's someone that kills dogs. vision batteries. Nice panic room that he's got here. everything all right I think we're good what the hell are you ready to go yet at last our game is ending wait game when great men rise they will clash it's inevitable Calvert and I are both men of great power but today, our rivalry ends. Now let's go. Kind of want to kill him too a little bit. I fixed the lighthouse. <laughs> I didn't get an XP or complete a quest or anything though. Which makes me kind of sad. Cleared out most of the stuff that was already here with the Meyer Larks.
this is convenient. Underground lab. Uh-oh, alarms. I know I'm over encumbered. Leave me alone. Why is there even a bathroom here? Alright, I got this. Receiving. Uh, adventure? Damn. Uh, temporary? First, buddy. Hurry up. Here you go. Here you go. Just a little. Max withdraws. I should help him. Oh my god, pencils. To Dr. Stewart, from unknown. Hey, Rap. You don't like people having a little fun, huh? Well, let's see how fun it is for you when you're out of the street looking for work. You tatter on the wrong guy. I hate to bother you, but it happened again. Unless it's Daniel and Prito, I'm sure they're always missing me. No matter how many reports I file with the main office, they're never disciplined, ever. You and I both know it's because Danielson's uncle is married to the senator. Calvert's daughter, can't you stop it? Do something! Pre-war book. I don't see many of those. Michelson and this facility is built to withstand the unique pressures of subway machine and earth and construction, but recently a few concerns about the integrity of the initial work. This is in more than a few leaks with a logical source, and has a number of them very nervous to say, should they be able to go on to the facility's office? 
pressure regulators are keeping visibly dry and clean for hundreds of years on their internal batteries, but given his history with this sort of thing, I'm not exactly comforted by his claims. I'm hoping that he can find an inspector with proper clearance to give a state of an evaluation in the lab. To all of us, it has been brought to my attention that a number of us. <laughs> Any attempts at social engagement with clinical participants is a violation of Facility Rule 47 for social. Interaction interferes with cerebral infusion and can cause a number of potential problems once the procedure reaches completion. So once again, do not speak to participants. Be sure to limit any internal monologues to the list found in section 2.3. I'm guessing Dr. Stewart is the guy that made this dude like he is. As a reminder, only authorized archive technician can access the micro micro fish fish library. So we're going to missing people find better ways to make yourself feel what you in here. I always vote sex to keep myself amused. Constant and frequent masturbation. Damn it! Research progress notes by using the data we collected from the researchers in general. Atomics, the closest to the robo brain, we've been able to fully mimic the brain suspension and isolation techniques to make robo brains function. What's better, we've made some interesting advances. It turns out that manipulating the composition of the bio med gel, we're able to produce a number of effects that were previously thought to be impossible. Since the doctor was right, under the right conditions, the subject not only retains full mental capacity but can project limited images and even thoughts to other minds while the correct conditions are introduced in the biomed suspension. Nice! This has profound implications for application from battlefield technology to civilian criminal interrogation. Although one must wonder if years of isolation and biological suspension would eventually introduce psychological abnormalities, this merits further study once the full breadth of the current research is explored. Despite the early stage of the research, Dr. Stewart was reported to Senator Calvert as demanding a full report on work immediately, seeing that he is sending his brother, a noted researcher in the field of cognitive robotic, to this very lab in order to participate in our study and assist with us to report. I have to say, I said short work to anyone else at the lab. It's still very early and very unstable. It will be decades before we can be sure that this, that the cognitive broadcast is not just stable, alone, well, ready for perhaps a we'll to wrap up for a few months. At least we've given some time to come to better conclusions. Stealth boy wore off. Aww. I'll just have to put on another. I got too friggin' many of them. I swear to god, every time the lock. Every time it's left. Like the last ten times I've done it, it's left. You know what? I'm just going to force the lock. Because <laughs> it was a 100% success chance. And I still broke a bobby pin. Got here? 
mind. Just let me, just let me. Ammunition box. There we go. I don't like how I can't look at those. crippled. It's okay, I just drove a stim pack needle into my head. Why do robots need security badges? I mean, they're robots. I'm just saying. I do need cameras. Metal spoon. Wait, why do we need the scrap metal again? It's just down this way. to give me a piece of your mind. Always so full of talk.
guess she is quite good at killing things because she keeps crippling my goddamn head. Keep talking. I can fucking well walk. You know nothing. You are nothing. If you're such a man of will, attack me and be done with it. What do you fear for your life? The world is rid of that sniveling, disgusting, arrogant brain. Think of it. Everything he learned, everything he had, it's all here, and it's all mine. Mine. Moron, you cannot possibly comprehend what this is worth. I've been battling with Calvert for over 200 years, and now at last, I am the victor. And now... 200 years of technology, knowledge, and research that he stole from me. Every time he beat me, it doesn't matter now. You're free to take whatever you find in this disgusting place. What I came for is of no interest to you. Enjoy your spoils. I don't think our paths will ever cross again. And I think we can both thank Christ and say hallelujah for that. <laughs> vision batteries on them. Manix withdrawal. There's his brain. At least I think it's his brain. I guess we're best fucking friends now. I'm pulling all the data that I can from Calvert's computers. Everything the little bastard gathered is here. And then, when I'm done, I'll leave this place to sink into the sea. Now that we're rid of Calvert, I'll be heading north to pursue my next rival. There are only a few of us left now. The great game goes on. Sort of a... Uh, what's a word you'd understand? Microcosm? Yeah. It's a microcosm for the old world. I do not understand that word. I do not know what a microcosm is. What is this? Hmm.
You know, it pisses me off when I need to unlock stuff inside here. Okay, clearly this is a workbench. Why can't I make it? There we go. I know, over encumbered. I don't know if I need any of this shit, but. We'll just loot it all and then sort it after. Uh, what the fuck is a nuke a grenade? I don't have a crutch or a pressure cooker. Well, I have none of those things. Um, anything I can drop? I don't really need money. That's me a 300. Come on. I guess I can drop a few of these. Okay. Um, technically done the DLC. Oh, I. But I haven't checked out all, all the places, of Madame so. Panada's wares are top quality. I'm gonna take everything you own, madam. Oh, you don't have like any money. I'll take I'll take these. Good enough for me. Of course, I learned many tricks from my father. New people, welcome back to Haley's Hardware. Look around, it's all here. He has a lot of money. Anything I want? Nope. Uh, 
try to get through these quick. Jesus Christ, so many. Uh, I don't need this or this. The microwave emitter I would like to try out. Oh wait, I didn't mean to sell that, but eh, it doesn't matter. Shot glass? When did I loot a shot glass? I don't have any turpentine. There we go. It's kind of even. Behold the hamburger necklace. What? Are right, you talking about my headset? Maybe if you are late, but I have arrived. Yeah, it's in chocolate. You're only two hours late, so it's only six a.m. and uh, across the pond. Men's coveralls. I'm gonna buy from him. Kinda need more scrap scrap be like stuff. How do you get a power helmet? More fission batteries, but did he have any sensor module? No, he didn't. Uh, I guess I'll take the two scrap metals and all your tin cans, and that still didn't do it. God damn, that's good enough for me. I don't even care.